What's going on, my fellow nerds and geeks? Today, we are doing the BAM box of January, the horror. This is my last horror BAM box, and I have actually already seen the contents of this box. And as you can see, I'm kind of gimpy. <laughs> I hurt my shoulder, so... Um, this is late, which the lateness doesn't really bother me. Uh, there's a lot of unique items that come in the band box, so I understand that, you know, with the autographs and all the other cool props and stuff, that's not what bothers me about this box. And like I said, I have already seen it because it is so late. We did, um, some people have got started getting them today. Uh, so I will just jump right in. So as always, we got the black paper. So I'm gonna start with the, the thing that I just, I, it's like the what's in the box Barbie head they sent not a very long time ago. So this is, it's a pill bottle. It's from, uh, Nightmare on Elm Street 3, I think. It's Nancy's pill bottle for the sleeping meds that she gets. You can kind of read on there. Uh, I love Dark Matter props. They have some cool stuff. And the other prop in here is very cool. It's not something that I don't really know a lot about the movie because I haven't seen it since I was a kid. But this, I, there's nothing I can do with this. I, don't even, I wouldn't even want to have this up in my display with my stuff. A lot of the Dark Matter props I have up on display because they are very cool. And I love BAM box. I probably will not stop getting the original box. Like I said, the horror box has been a great box, but it's a lot of, to me, it's a lot of lesser known movies for stuff. So uh, this is a great, I was really excited for the Nightmare on Elm Street prop. Oh yeah. Um, <laughs> I was really excited for it, but then when I saw that, I was like, Ugh, there's nothing, I, I, yeah, I just, that's it, that, that, that's my rant, I, I can't do anything with that, but this now, this is the other prop that's in there, which this is from The Exorcist, I believe, and this is the, the main demon from The Exorcist, which this is really cool. I mean, if you're a big Exorcist fan, this would be awesome to have in, in your collection. I mean, even not being an Exorcist fan, it does look really cool. It's got like a broken, I don't know how you display it. You'd have to like set it on its side because it doesn't really have a way of setting up. But I mean, it's still, it's it's a very cool prop. And if you really like the, the movie, that's, that is, would be really cool. I'm not gonna stretch over my arm again because that hurt. <laughs> And then the pin this month, and it looks like I didn't get any one up. So uh, this is from the movie Salem's Lot, which I've never actually seen this movie. So, and I believe they said this is a um, a uh, fan art, yeah, fan art enamel pins. Which their enamel pins are always cool. They always do some really cool stuff. Uh, I'm sure if you're a fan of Salem's Lot, which like I said, I've never actually seen the movie, so I don't really know. So, and then this is the print that is in here. I got 226 out of 1500. So this is the print. And I can't remember what movie this is from. Fan art collection print, Insidious which that's another one that I have not seen. Like I said, I don't watch a lot of horror movies. I love old slasher films. That's why I was so excited for The Nightmare on Elm Street because I was hoping for something, you know, Nightmare on Elm Street that I would be able to put up. So I was really excited about it. So this is the last thing in the box. And this is Pin has been signed by the Soska twins, Jen and Sylvia. I don't know 
I'm doing a private sign. They direct they directed American Mary, which I you know I have not seen that. But from what I've heard, there was a lot of people pretty excited to have their autographs. So, um, and they're, I mean that that's cool to me. Even though I don't know who they are, to get an autograph, and then not to mention you get both their autographs, that's really cool. So, and that was the last thing, and we've got the the book which it's not really a book it's just a piece of paper but it's better than the, when they did the digital thing so you can kind of see there was two different versions of the print like more of a black and white version and then there's two different versions of the autograph print and then the pins down at the bottom and then there's the monthly giveaway item which yet again the reanimator. <laughs> I haven't seen that either. I've I've heard that it's it's a good classic movie, but I just myself haven't seen it. Um, and I know that there is for the the autograph. There's actually a upgraded item that is. Uh, I think it says on here. So, we'll, so it says most will get one of two signed photos, but look out for the signed directors clapboard so there is a clapboard also so that is it for the bam box horror my last bam box horror like i said uh, most everything has always been really good with the bam box but unfortunately the pill bottle i just you know i i can't do anything with the pill bottle <laughs> i mean i think that was I, I, yeah, that's all I'm going to say about it. We'll leave it at that. You guys can comment down below with what you think. Let me know. Holler. Like I said, this is the last horror box. I am going to keep, I'm really excited for the next, the, the OG box because it is the two year anniversary box and the last anniversary box, the first year anniversary box was really, really good. So I'm really looking forward to that. So as always, like, subscribe, leave some comments down below, and don't forget to ring the bell if you want to get the new content. And as always, stay awesome.